Good morning guys. Welcome back to my channel. It has been almost two weeks since I've even picked up the camera. I've just had stuff like pre-filmed. Um, and by stuff I mean one video pre-filmed. Um, this has to be quick because my camera's dying. But I'm going to vlog my day today. Um, we had a really crazy week in the Levitt family household last week. Um, Riley had to get emergency surgery on Monday. And today is Monday. So we are a week out from that. Um, recovery's been hard. Moving's been hard. I mean, I'm literally tackling this day because our house is a wreck. Sorry, I got cut off because my camera died. And then Oakland woke up and I made all of the banana bread. But anyways, I have no idea what I said before, but we had a crazy week. My house is a total disaster. Um, we really need to clean it up. But I have some leftover bananas because uh, Riley's mom was here with us this week while Riley was recovering from his surgery. She got in the night that he had surgery. Um, and I'm actually gonna make a whole like update video on what's going on in our lives. Our move, our surgery, all that kind of stuff and like why it's been so rough and I'll insert clips of his surgery and stuff like that. Today is just like a normal recovering day in the life vlog. It's been real stressful. Hi, yo, ma'am. Hello, ma'am. Hey. Hello. You're beautiful. So, I have the oven preheating for the banana bread, and I've started to kind of clean up and pick up. Got some teethers for Oakland, some frozen ones. That's why her cheeks are a little bit red. She's definitely teething. Um, they haven't cut through, but like her gums are just getting really sore and swollen. You can see it. So it's just been like a teething baby, a husband who has surgery, a dog who's just frazzled because everything's going weird. My sister has had Tiny Pal for the last two weeks, week and a half, I think, um, which has been so helpful. It's been so so nice to like get the routine get this house settled the way that we need it settled and then we can like bring tiny pal back in he'll come back I think tomorrow um, but especially the week with surgery like Duke is very on our schedule and tiny pals very on his family's schedule and so I mean we didn't have time to go on long walks we let him outside we played with them but like we didn't have time to go on multiple walks a day um, we're really lazy and just laying around and Duke is used to that. He enjoys that. So I'm really grateful to my sister for watching Tiny Bell because that has made it a million times easier, even though it was very, very hard. So anyways, I show you, I'll show you this. I made a loaf of banana bread and this is not a recipe that I've ever used before. Um, and then I just had some leftover. So I did some muffins just because I didn't have enough to make a whole loaf. And I definitely want to use all of that. Um, if you guys don't follow Allie Richmond or Whimsical, um, Whimsical on Instagram, she's like one of my favorites. She has three little girls, well, just triplets, and then she just had another baby girl um, just shortly after Oakland was born. So it's so much from following her. She bakes all the time and like makes these delicious recipes. So I'm really excited that she shared her recipe so I could try it. And of course I had all the ingredients somehow, which is awesome. So I'm getting our life back in order and just, I'm uploading a vlog right now. It's been, I only posted one video last week. Um, and then I posted, I was, I've been trying to post this video, the one that's uploading right now. And I couldn't, and it's not for lack of trying or for like filming. Like it's not like, oh my gosh, this is so stressful. I can't film or upload. We have literally such terrible Wi-Fi. I need to pull. Thank you. Your face and your hands are so cold from this. Um, we have absolutely awful Wi-Fi. It is 1240. I started uploading at 1043 and it is 19% done. Like it's been two hours and it's not even close to being done. So I don't know how that's gonna work because we're here for February, March, and April, and a little bit of May. So like three and a half more months, like I can't be posting one video a week because it takes me literally a week to upload. So um, I might have to go to a coffee shop, 
like two or three days a week with Oakland and just sit there for a little bit and upload or if we go see Riley's family like just try to bulk upload um, and then have them ready for the week I don't know I wanted to be authentic and like real time with you guys but if it's taking me a week to upload something and then like more stuff has happened I don't know it just doesn't feel great so I don't know I'm very stressed I feel like I don't have any time to, for me to like express my feelings or shower or relax for me um, because Riley is recovering, Oakland is needy, she's teething, she's having a hard time sleeping still just because we've been moving and sleeping in so many different places, she's not used to it. Um, but you're my little girl and I love you so much. But, ow, 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 ow. And obviously wouldn't change any of it for the world. Um, and Riley can't hold her for four weeks. I don't know if I said that before, but you can't lift anything 20 pounds or over for four weeks. Um, in her car seat, she's way over 20 pounds, and by herself, she's like 16. Um, so if I need him to, he can like hold her, but he can't pick her up and like do like the picking up. So I already have to have her and like hand him to her while he's sitting or something because he has the three incisions on his stomach, so he can't like sit with her he has to be like standing and have him on her hip but then he gets really tired because he's still like recovering and on medicine and so it's gonna be a hard four weeks for me um and, but i can't like i'm not like oh i wish someone would do more for me i just need this time to talk to the camera and just get my feelings out i think so oh man i hope that video uploads today at some point because it's monday i want to upload monday wednesday friday um six minutes of me rambling and there's nothing going on but just a life update in this day in the life vlog so i'm sorry oh boy did we drop our tea though sorry we have a couple of things to do if i can get them done today i need to be cleaning i need to take some stuff to a consignment sh store because we should not have moved with as much clothes as we did like it's ridiculous hi ma'am are you all done i'm getting hungry okay Fine with me. I understand completely. So, I don't know. It's just, I don't know. I don't know what's going on. I don't know what to do. I just am frazzled and tired of sitting down, but I feel like I need to just sit down and take a break. I want to be up and doing stuff, but I can't. I'm just exhausted. So, anyways, that's off right now. This banana bread's going to go in the oven cook it for about an hour i'm so excited i will try to link if i remember by the time i'm freaking uploading this try to link ali's video down below um with the recipe in it because i'm sure this is going to be fantastic she makes like four loaves a week for her kids and her so i'm super excited this is really long i'll be back this is literally the best banana bread i've ever had i don't normally put chocolate chips in it but it's so good my loaf was really long instead of like wide which i use my mom's pan so i'm not used to so it broke in half and i took it out but it's perfect um and the recipe said an hour since mine was long and shallow i did like 35 40 minutes however the muffins i didn't really think about this are super burnt the tops are fine bottoms are super burnt so these i'll eat like around the bottom but the bread is perfect like it's literally so good but i came down here to get my camera oakland is taking her second nap of the day it's three o'clock um she's way behind schedule she normally falls asleep her nap should have been at two and she fell asleep at like 2 50 but she's sleeping so I'm coming into our guest room in our closet. I'm gonna go through all of this stuff and see what I can take to like um, Plato's closet or I don't even know what the other ones are, but.
Like I said, I literally, that took me five minutes. I went through everything. So I didn't touch any of Riley's stuff just because these are his stuff. He does actually wear all of these things. Just takes them a little longer. Um, this is the side now. I got rid of a bunch of jackets. This is like a Helly Hansen jacket, a puffer, some vests, all of those things. I kept most of my dresses and skirts just because I wear them to church. Um... And some of them have like sentimental feelings behind them. Like this dress I wore, I've worn since Riley and I were dating. And I wore it to like this important thing before we got married, to his graduation, when I was pregnant. Like I've just, I've worn it. I love that dress. Um, this is just a great dress for if you're like running late to church and your mom. So like you want to be comfy. Anyways, I just kept these things because they're important. Like this one I wore at my wedding um, just to dance in. It's like one of my favorite dresses. And then this is what's left here. So this vest, just because I think my mom will want it when she comes back. Ton of these basic tees from um, Down East Basics. They're so great for underneath stuff. My Tom Brady jersey. This is literally my favorite shirt, my Adidas shirt. And then this pink Lululemon jacket I'm going to try to put on Poshmark and sell. I wear this shirt all the time. Just a couple of extra things that like I do frequently wear. So this is my huge pile. It's literally ginormous. So now I'm going to try to get it into my bag and like fold it all so that I can do this. Let me take it. Let me take it out here. And also, I'm selling a ton of my old phone cases. Obviously, I have a new one. So I have ones that fit um, like seven and eight, six, seven, eight plus phones. So. I got a little friend to help me. She woke up from her nap, so I do wig now. <sighs> I'm tired.
Good sitting, honey. That's it. Whoa! <laughs> okay, I found a shirt that I wanted to keep. I have wanted to give this away for a long time, so I haven't been wearing it. And then I've lost weight since obviously having hair, and I feel like it just like, I feel like it just like fits me better now than it used to. So, that's one for the keep. Why do I always do this? Mm hmm. Was someone was not feeling that, so mom's gonna take a break. We're gonna go back downstairs, get our toys, <sighs> and I will start cleaning the kitchen. I'm the worst at starting something and finishing it at like one time. I will start a million projects, I'm very ambitious, but I will finish mm, two out of the ten that I start. I'll finish them eventually, but just. I never will finish them when I start them. Something always comes up. I get very distracted very easily. Yeah. I get very distracted. Oh. oh my gosh, it's so messy. It's just like stuff that needs to go away, but we don't have a place for it. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Huh. It's so pretty. It's a little bit, not a little bit, it's much later, and <gasps> Riley's doing some stuff on the computer. Oakland and I were doing some like paperwork stuff right there, um, but it's her bedtime, so I was getting up to get the stuff ready, but then I saw my camera, so. <laughs> you are so cute, ma'am. So. I had another shirt change. I did a workout. I did some Zumba, and she was jumping in her Jolly Jumper, and it was so fun. Felt really good to get a little workout in, so now that I know I can do that and I love dancing, I feel like I'm gonna try to do that more, like do it more times in the week. Charge my Apple Watch, like keep up on that kind of stuff so that I can track it, and it just makes me feel good. Oh, not happy. I love these jammies from Burt's Bees. I love all of their jammies. I can't find them on Amazon. Oh, excuse you. They don't have very many colors on Amazon. And I only buy her the snug fit because she's little and you can see like they're still kind of loose on her and they have like a loose fit and it does not fit at all. But I will link these below. I get them at Target online because my Target doesn't carry them except for like the Christmas jammies. Um, but they have like all different kinds. She has so many pairs of these Burt's Bees jammies. It's the only, pair, the only kind that I buy. But we are just working on some like background stuff and papers. Watching 90 Day Fiance, which is like our show right now. It's so good. Um, and I probably need to make dinner. It's time is it? 8.30. Her nap was 10 minutes ago. Um, it's pretty late for a nap, but she doesn't normally go to bed until like 11. Anyways, so that's normal for us. So yeah, I just wanted to update because I haven't updated in a while. I haven't finished all of the clothes, but oh, but I will. And yeah, that's all. Okay, it is the next day. It's almost four o'clock and I just got back home. I had a mommy lunch. Um, we planned it like right at everyone's nap time. So all three girls were sleeping. 
um, for like the first 30 minutes. Then they all woke up and just played all three together. Like literally, I'm so shocked. I don't even have a six month old. And then the other girl six months and then a one year old. And they all just sat on the floor together and played with the toys. And like none of us did anything. Like we were just around watching them eating pizza. Like it was so fun. I can't believe. <laughs> I don't even know how to describe it. It was so fun. Hey. <laughs> It was a lot of fun. I'm so happy to have my mom friends and to be able to hang out and actually do stuff with them if we all live pretty close. So that was really, really fun. Um, I'm freezing now, oh, this house is so cold. But Oakland woke up from her second nap. She fell asleep um, at the end while we were there just talking. Um, but she woke up and we got home and I need to clean and organize still. So I'm gonna end this vlog. Um, I haven't taken anything to Play-Doh's closet or anything like that. Literally, I stopped vlogging last night and then woke up, got ready, went to lunch, and we just got home. So I'm gonna end the vlog here. So make sure you're subscribed. I love you guys, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.